We're here on the Heimer booth at AMB to talk about a real world revolution. Now, Andreas, what are we looking at today? Tom, I'm so excited and pumped up to show this to you because that's really for the first time in history ever in the presetting field, measuring field tool room, we have real artificial intelligence, enhanced software and database that actually the presetting machine will autonomously, not automated, autonomously identify the cutting tool, teach himself and automate the process. So it's really very exciting. So all I have to do is I press the button here twice and it will start. It doesn't know which tool it is. It doesn't know if it's an end mill or drill or face mill, but it will automatically position. It will check his database. Is it an end mill? Is it a drill? Is it a face mill? And it will automatically say for a drill, I need to measure the shoulder one, the shoulder two, the highest point. Or for the end mill, I will identify now. Now it's measuring edge four, one, edge two, edge three, but it didn't know the information before. So this machine is really a revolution in presetting. That's absolutely amazing. Now obviously we see AI in, in other products, but never at all presetting. So what advantages does this give over a standard presetter? Absolutely, you know, and with, with the technologies, if you have an automated presetter, here you see we have measured all four flutes. So that means like now the magic happens. I can go back and say, I want to play that back. I have the tolerances. I have the measuring program. I say playback and I say here like it's a mill. It has four flutes. I say here MTDCNC123 and I save that. I go saving, so it will now ask me link this to a unique ident number, so I can scan it to a unique ident number and say I want to use this to this unique ident number, and I say yes, I want to save it. So for the future, it's always stored. You can always trace it back. So that means like I can also now print on a label or send the data to it. But the point is, it is linked to actually it is linked to the unique ident number. So instead of programming and teaching manually where operators can make an error like I missed a flute or I have to know what I what do I want to measure with a drill this autonomous machine will tell you what to measure for an end mill it will tell you what to measure for a drill it will tell you for a face mill so it's a real revolution here you have your MTD CNC one two three it's linked to this unique end number and we speak about the start of the artificial intelligence revolution in the tool room the tool room of the future it's happening now and this is just the beginning now obviously You've talked about how this can help a company, but what about the skills gap? Because if you've got to teach an apprentice what's the difference between a drill, a face mill, a four flute end mill, you don't have to do that anymore. He can run this and you will know that when you get that tool for your machine, it's right. So why did you decide to go down this route? Yeah, absolutely. Like you said, the skills gap, it's a great point. You know, the times are gone in Germany, UK or worldwide where you had 20 uh, people working in the shop for 20 years in the tool room. So with this technology, you can take a person that has for the first time operated a presetter and on the first day of the job, he will perform the same repeatable job than a guy with 10 years of experience. At the same time, you're taking off the burden from your skilled labor that you can use for programming, you can use for running machine this will automatically run basically so he can take care of other jobs so it will help to softening and bridge the skills gap by this new technology and then obviously like we've said before all the data this creates can either go straight into your machine or with the scanner you have your little form so when that operator or apprentice has run this and gives it to the machinist they know that tool, they can put it in, press the green button, and there is no problem. Absolutely, you know, you have seamless data connectivity. We show here connectivity to Siemens, Heidenheim, Fanuc, Mesodrol, Silos from DMG Mori. So any kind of, we can send the data live in there. And that brings me back to why do you originally need a presetter? Because you keep your machines running, making chips, making you money, and not wasting time for setup doing it in the machine. So it reduces scrap it 
avoids the danger of collision. And with this technology, you know, it even makes it easier to be accessible, even for small jobs that have job shops that have a thousand tools, they have never digitized it. Do you know how a thousand tools to program, to teach, but with this technology, it makes automation and digitization just more accessible because it will teach itself. So you can apply modern technology right away without having the hassle of having a person programming it. But also, last, last question, this must be more accurate than a machine tool as well, because obviously if you're measuring on a machine tool, you're measuring all your different types of cutters, end mills, face mills, through one solo setter. But with this, it's changing itself to measure the right information for the right tool. So this must be more accurate is, on its own as well. Absolutely, it's much more accurate than a machine tool. It clamps the same way like in a machine tool. You can even say for the interfaces, you program it towards, you have HSK 63, HSK 100. You can even set it to the spindle of the machine tool. So you have a lot of opportunities. Plus, the main point is your machine tool should not be the most expensive presetter in the world. You have one presetter sending data to 10, 20, 30 uh, machine tools, and you can earn much more money by that. Now, Andreas, AI has come a long way. What you've done with it is incredible, and I cannot wait to see what you guys do next. Tom, so thank, thank, thank you, you so very much. much. I appreciate Absolutely it. Thank brilliant. you for thank coming you. to AMB Show. Thank you for checking out the Heimabos. See you. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay.